Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Like, comment, definitely subscribe if you want to. So Beyonce has released a new album, Cowboy Kata. I am going to be honest, I haven't listened to their album in full. I've listened to a few songs. So far, everything I've listened to, I liked. I liked Second Most Wanted. I liked um, Texas Hold'em, obviously. I like Blackbird. That was really good. And um, I also liked Jolene. Now, speaking of Jolene, I don't know who told Beyonce that... It, okay, so it's obviously a song. She didn't write it herself. It's a cover of a very popular song by another popular artist, Dolly Parton. But girl, babe, I like... No one... <laughs> this is so horrible i'm sorry but like jay-z is no one's taste like people girls who want jay-z are obviously after him for his money and i get that you have your own money and you're with him like i get it people are very difficult to understand and you know we like what we like we we we, we adore, like we love who we love we can't choose Oh, I mean, we can't, but, like, sometimes you just fall in love with someone and you can't do anything about it. But, like, I'm so tired of this narrative. Oh, well, but every time I hear or, like, get a whiff of Beyonce saying something equivalent to people wanting to go after her man, it's like, babe, no one wants your man except for his money. And it was so funny. <laughs> It was so funny seeing people drag her to absolute filth um, on this matter, including Azalea Banks. Like, I don't like Azalea Banks. She's, I think she has a lot of terrible takes, but she was really, what she said was actually quite funny. Like, nobody wants your man, Beyonce. Jay-Z, no, no, mm, I don't know. This is a pointless video, but I just felt like putting something out there about this. The song is an amazing um, rendition of the original but Beyonce said I'm warning you she didn't say I'm begging you she said I'm warning you what are you gonna do Beyonce what are you gonna do as a matter of fact you should be looking to divorce his ass because the shit that's coming out about him and you know after all this Diddy stuff has come out I don't know I would be looking to like distance myself from sean carter if i were you because this does not look good for your legacy like big talk from someone who has defended nikki and her husband like but but i've said this over and over again with nikki there is evidence to suggest that she lied i mean no the uh kenneth petty was lied on by the woman a lot of people don't believe this and that's fine but like yeah babe no one was your husband no one was your man if they want him they want him for his money anyway let me know what you think about this thanks for sticking around bye bye bye